Welcome to the 60 second geography short on systems, a key concept to A-level geography. A systems approach is used in geography to simplify the physical and human world into interconnected and interdependent components, which enable us to see how they link and why they change over time. The systems approach emphasises the relationships and interactions between these components, considering how inputs, processes and outputs affect the system as a whole. In the A-level course, systems can be seen when looking at cities in terms of inputs and outputs, and when looking at processes of erosion, transportation and deposition in the systems and landscapes options on paper one. The systems approach is also important in the water and carbon cycles, looking at how both water and carbon move between different stores through various processes, such as evaporation and condensation for water, and photosynthesis and respiration for carbon. An example of a system is the carbon budget, which is the amount of carbon being stored and transferred within the global carbon cycle. The input of CO2 into the atmosphere is occurring faster than natural processes can remove it, which is creating an imbalance in the system, thus leading to climate change.